एवरीवन वेलकम बैक इन दिस वीडियो वी गोइंग टू एक्सप्लोर द फैसिनेटिंग वर्ल्ड ऑफ क्रिएटिंग अ रेट्रो और विंटेज लुक इन फिल्म रा whether you want to add a nostalgic touch to your videos or achieve a special aesthetic this tutorial will guide you through the process hence let's get started to begin with import your footage into filmora and drag it onto the timeline ensure that you have the desired clip selected the first step is to apply the vintage filter to the footage click on the effects tab and navigate to the vintage category here you'll find a variety of pre-designed vintage filters scroll through the options and choose the one that fits you best You can preview each filter by hovering over it and clicking the play button. Now, let's fine tune the saturation and contrast to enhance that retro feel. Head over to the color tab for more precise adjustment. Experiment with the saturation slider to desaturate the color slightly. This will give your footage a faded look. Next, adjust the contrast to add depth and richness. Film grain is a crucial element in achieving an authentic vintage look. It adds texture and mimics the appearance of old film stock. Go to the effects tab and search for film grain. Drag and drop the film grain effect onto your footage. You can adjust the intensity of grain by modifying the settings in effects control panel. Aim for a subtle grain effect to maintain a balance between authenticity and visual clarity. To further enhance the vintage vibe, we will apply color toning. But wait, there's more. With Motivel's new powerful color correction tools, Take precise control of your color wheels, sharpen your shots, and you can experience the new enhanced color correction algorithm with added support for LUTs and flexibility of effect mask, creating stunning color grades that has never been easier. If you want to try all of these, you can just download the Filmora 12 from link in description. Now let's continue with the video. Head to the color tab again and explore the different presets available. You can experiment with warm tones, cool tones, or even sepia effects. Remember to adjust the intensity of color toning to ensure it complements your footage. And we're almost done. Take a moment to review your footage and make any final adjustment you need. You can refine the color grading by using the various color correction tools Filmora provides. Once you're satisfied with the results, it's time to export your video. Click on the export button, choose your desired settings, and let Filmora work upon it. And then you have finally learned how to create a retro or vintage look in Filmora. Remember to experiment and explore different techniques to achieve the exact aesthetic you desire. And I hope you found this tutorial helpful and something new. If so, do the like button, share, and subscribe. Until then, thanks for watching. Bye.